Okay, let's test the whole thing. So I'll save it. It's active. I will go back and remember now I have two different types of invoices. So I go back to Google Drive. Well, I will delete, yeah. Uh, I'll delete this one. And I will now put first the PDF, okay? And then the, the image. Oopa. And then the image. Yeah, they are the same. They are the same. Okay, it's the same, but in different uh, format: PNG and PDF. It doesn't really. It's not really. And I will also add one of the Google. Imp one of the. Yeah, the three. Why not the three invoices? Let's see what happens because the workflow should be working. So we have one image, three PDFs, and one of the image. This is repeated, so that's okay. That's not. It's also it's even better so that we see if the system. It's flexible enough okay and I think that okay I don't know if it was executed already I wasn't paying attention executions templates workflows temp workflows this one executions of this 13 15 mm, no so I will delete I uh, know now it started remember that there were in the Google Sheets there were five rows so now we will watch from the row um six onwards i'll post this this one is taking longer i get i assume the reason is because of the um, the amazon recognition uh, takes a bit longer but look at this is taking much longer okay and according to this it has succeeded Let's see, let's take a look. There were four items, good. Three items went through the PDF path, great, fantastic. And one item went through the image path, okay? Let's see if the Google Sheets, and this number two, it means that it was executed in different, uh, coming from different uh, inputs, right? Uh, let's go to see if the, re and remember that the Google Sheets, the first five were from before, okay, the first, one, two, three, four, five, where from before, and then Google Cloud, something we didn't, I will delete everything because something we didn't get it. Eh? So there was some problem. We got three from Google and only one from GitHub. This is one, and I don't know if it's the one that com comes from PDF or comes from, from image. So. What I will do, I will do something else. I will add image type, a new column called image type. Oh, sorry, image type, file. To, and I will add a new property so that we have control. I will delete this. I will keep, remove them so that we know which one is working and which one it's not working, okay? Uh, let's go back to the workflow edit and I will put here a new property final string text the text it's well I, I want to see what happened in the execution one moment on this path yeah this was what was returned <coughs> uh. Let's see. Okay, here. Look, the two all the in, all the times that we that received uh, something. Ah, okay. JSON text. JSON. Three items from read PDF. No, I want to see the one that I received from from the other code. This one. Hmm. What's happening here? Uh, the final output. JSON. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, okay, okay, okay. There, there's a small problem. Well, um, there's a small problem here. Yes. That I added a property. Let's see if I find the property. Yeah, this is the property added at the end. You see? 
Yeah, this is the, the property that I added, text. So I will add an additional node to clean this up because this looks like a mess to me. So I will, I will, I will do something here like, uh, okay, I'll, I'll fix it in the next video.